Today we are back on the county line map. This morning I awoke to just over four and a half inches of snow. We'll be heading out plowing this morning. We'll be using our Ford pickup truck for the residential driveways and then switching over to a cat skid steer. Let's take a full walk around really quickly of our Ford truck. It's a 2011 Ford F-350 regular cab long bed. We have a Boss DXT V plow on the front with a snow dog salter. For today's video, I really wanted to have a work truck style. And this, I believe, is probably the best work trucks. Uh, the regular cab, the salter, and the V plow. Let's hop on the inside, get the power stroke warmed up. Now it looks like the town plows have not come out and dropped salt or even cleared the roads. So we'll have to kind of keep the truck here in four wheel drive as we plow. Let's first do our driveway here and it looks like traffic is uh, slowly uh, getting by this morning. I'm excited to be back here snow plowing in FS19. This winter I've been doing a lot of plowing and have really been enjoying it. And you guys have also uh, been liking it as well. Now the first pass down the driveway, I always just did the V. It's just a little bit easier here. It gives us a little bit more power as well uh, with uh, pushing the snow. Now I also decided to go with the uh, polyester plow instead of the stainless steel, it's a bit cheaper and it uh, still does the same job. But this is one awesome work truck here. I do want to fill the salter and maybe do some videos going around salting the different properties uh, that we take care of. Even if we don't get snow, sometimes we do have to go out and uh, salt to make sure no one slips and falls. And I think that's the best we're going to do. We'll have to get out the snow blower for uh, that little area. Now I think the only thing to top off this truck would be uh, to get some strobe lights on it. That would look awesome. A few in the grill, a uh, small light bar up top, and a few here on the salter. Let's do this residential driveway. This is actually a pretty big one here for us. A lot of snow we have to move. I hope everyone's having a great day so far. Let me know how it is down below. My day's been uh, so far so good. The temperatures have been warming up, which is also great. Now, I definitely would like to get some more snow to do some snow blowing videos, and I definitely want to do a few more of those if possible. Now, this is a pretty big driveway here, so we'll have to be careful as well because uh, this is a pretty busy road that we are on. Now I really do like the V plows, just so versatile, especially with all the different things we could do, the V, the scoop, or just regular straight blade action at times. Once a spring comes into full effect, we more than likely uh, will be slowing down on these plowing videos. I do want to do a few more here before it's over, and then I think we'll kind of hold off and probably do a, a, a few throughout the off season. Let's do this uh, area of the driveway, nice V plow action, and uh, we'll just kind of drive through that little pile there. We'll do one more pass here, make the driveway a little bit wider, and we're on to the next one. We have a lot of plowing counts here, and we are kept very busy uh, during the uh, snowfalls. And there we go. That looks awesome. Did a pretty good job here. Uh, this one did take us a little bit of time.
We'll do this driveway here. It's always tricky when they do not put out the markers, uh, but we should be good to go. Very long driveway. The V-plow, though, is always perfect for this. And as we approach, we turn that and push it right towards the fence. Perfect. I would like to thank all of you guys for the continued support here on the daily videos. I really do enjoy uploading every single day here to YouTube. It's a great hobby, great passion of mine, and I cannot wait for this uh, spring. This summer, some big changes are coming to the channel, which I, I cannot wait for. We made that a little bit wider now. Let's see if we can kind of get this a little bit wider over here uh, on this side of the driveway. But I think the regular cab long bed is the perfect work truck here, especially for plowing. It's a shorter wheelbase, and you have a lot more visibility out of the cab. And this area here looks to be a pretty uh, tricky area. Almost looks like there would be a driveway there, but uh, that kind of seems to be it there. Awesome. I think that's pretty much it here with the Ford plow truck. Let's head on over to the commercial a lot. It's a pretty big lot that will require a lot of plowing. And I think uh, we might actually use this uh, towards the end of it to kind of clean it up and maybe use it to uh, scoop some snow as well. And here we are, you guys can see it's a pretty big lot. We'll just kind of park on the side street here and get going. Now on this cat, we do have the snow tracks, which is definitely very helpful. It is always uh, tricky with the uh, track skid steers, but having the snow tracks really uh, kind of has no problem. Let's actually kind of start on the uh, smaller area first and then we'll kind of see how we do but I have noticed this plow from machine modding works really well but at times I have noticed it does skip a little bit of snow now skid steers are very popular for plowing and I really do like them but I do want to do some more videos with front loaders as well those are for the big big lots and as well uh, for the backhoes really uh, like backhoes I think they're great pieces of machinery. Let's actually kind of just rotate and go back. That way we could kind of clean up the same pass. And that way we could get a little bit uh, more done in a smaller amount of time. I have noticed that with all the plows for the skid steers, uh, they just are, don't work as well as the uh, trucks usually do. This cat skid steer though is moving a ton of snow and so far I have re really had no problems uh, traction wise. If you guys have not already I do recommend you go give me a follow over on Instagram. I do post every single day some pretty cool sneak peeks updates about the channel. More than likely the construction job that I have planned will uh, kind of come out towards the end of this week, if not all of next week. I cannot wait for that. We do have a few construction jobs lined up that you guys have been requesting construction and it will be coming very, very soon here. I've been a bit busy with school and I will have quite a bit of time over the next a week, week and a half to uh, kind of record the mini series. Let's plow out the entrance here and we'll kind of work, start on the other half now. Now there are a few cars here which always makes it a bit tricky uh, for really clearing the snow but I don't think we'll have a big problem there. Just trying to push back this uh, snow here first.
Perfect, so that looks to be good. We got those piles pushed back there really quickly. I just want to do in between these cars. It is always tricky going in between the cars, uh, but I don't think uh, there should be any problem. Once all of the cars go, uh, we'll kind of come back and push these piles to uh, the end. I have the heat cranked on right now, really keeping warm, and that's one of the biggest things about this, but I definitely want to kind of uh, use some more unique equipment for plowing as well, maybe some ATVs, things like that, uh, that uh, many people do use as well. What I actually want to do is I want to see if the truck is a bit more efficient. Let's hop in this. Maybe uh, since the truck has a very similar uh, plow size, it might be a little bit faster here. might do a little bit better of a scrape as well since uh, we've uh, been having some problems there with it, those plows. Let's see how this one does. Oh yeah, this plow works a lot, a lot better, you guys, since you're already moving a lot of snow. And this actually has a faster reverse gear as well. Let me know down below in the comments, guys, what is the favorite plow truck I've used so far? We've used a ton of different brands, uh, setups as well, from dualies to regular cabs to uh, uh, crew cab trucks. It's been awesome, and I definitely want to continue to use the uh, variety just to kind of showcase everything uh, that gets put to work during the season. This thing is doing such a great job here. Just look at that moving the snow. Within the next week, week and a half, we will be back with the American Truck Simulator and GTA 5. I got a few requests asking about the GTA. Yes, we will be back with it and some other uh, cool GTA 5 videos. Oh yeah, the truck's struggling right now to push a ton of snow. But wow, this thing moves a lot. Really working the uh, power stroke there, but I think that's pretty good here for today. It's been a very busy day here for us. A lot more work in ahead of us as we kind of continue here. But hope you guys enjoyed it. Getting to the cat skid steer here with the boss and also the F350. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned for next one and subscribe for more.